Video that went viral so quickly showing street racers doing donuts in a ring of fire on Seven Mile Road. Detroit police now saying, though, that they've made an arrest. Grant Herms live at Detroit Police Headquarters with the newest developments here. Grant. Well, Devin, police here at DPD say that they acted quickly when that video went viral. The chief calling in investigators immediately Monday morning. They said they, quote, brought out the big guns to track down these suspects and this suspect that they've now arrested who could be facing a lengthy list of criminal charges. We are actively investigating to identify a, a lot of people involved in that incident. <laughs> Police not releasing the name of the 31-year-old Detroiter they've arrested, but it is the first announced arrest in an incident that went viral on social media. Drivers on Sunday night captured at the intersection of Seven Mile and Greenfield doing donuts, and then a man appeared to pour gasoline in a circle, lighting it on fire. A dangerous situation for everyone there, with the potential for federal consequences. Lighting fires, and okay, we're going to make it a circle of death. I, I think there's some strong felony um, Repercussions. Police say the officers seen not rushing in were afraid for their own safety and worked to make sure everyone there was able to leave safely. But a spectator fleeing from the scene did hit a police cruiser on the way out. These certain individuals that want to take over a street, come out there for whatever reason, get more social media likes and put everybody, themselves, but everybody else in that type of jeopardy and danger. Today, DPD also issuing a warning for spectators who stood by and watched as the dangerous evening unfolded. Spectating is also as punishable as being the driver occupants of those vehicles. An arrest made in what's become a common issue in the heart of Detroit. And police are still looking for others involved in this incident. And again, they are stressing that these kinds of stunts are dangerous, not just for drivers and passengers, but for those around them. And as we just heard, they could also be criminal. Back to you. Uh, Grant, what do we know about the driver who was arrested? Well, that driver is a 31-year-old Detroit man, which is an interesting piece to this puzzle because over the summer, DPD had issued a warning to drivers coming from outside of the city to do these kinds of stunts. But obviously tonight, we are learning that this is a Detroit native and they're still looking for more suspects. Devin? All right, Grant.